Hey everyone, I'm Kaylee Searcy, a director with Esborne Books and More, and I'm gonna fly through some of our brand new mid-season 2017 releases. So first up we have one of our new little peek through books, Are You There Little Elephant? On this one, it has several finger trails for your baby to use for fine motor movements, and then literally you peek through to the next page to find the little elephant at the end cuddled up with his daddy all along. Let's Go to the Farm is another sequel. In this one, the friends um, that have previously gone to a play group are now gonna go to a farm. So their names are Billy and Bee, and they get to see all of the animals on the farm. This one, you can tell, is not a board book, but it does have nice, sturdy, shiny pages for your little ones so that they're probably not going to, to tear them too much. Um, at the end, they get very sleepy. They've had so much fun on the farm. They each say goodbye to their friends, and they go on home with their families. Cuddle Bear's Book of Hugs. This is great uh, sequel to our previous Cuddle Bear book that now he realizes that so many animals and people need hugs that he enlists his friends into their hug academy. So he teaches all of the Cuddle Bears how to give hugs to all kinds of animals, um, big, tall, slimy, and even some porcupines. Lift the Flap ABCs. We have Lift the Flap colors, numbers, shapes, etc. And these books are great because they are nice, thick, durable pages, thick, durable flaps. And you can see on here, it's not just about learning the ABCs, they're actually um, also learning the sequence of them. And along the bottom of every page is the full alphabet there for you. You can see on this one, they're learning a little bit of the phonics. So here's A, and it matches with the apron that the little farmer is wearing right there. And at the end, it has all of the letters with upper and lower case, which is great for their sight recognition. Lewd with the Sea Dog, I have to put on my little prop here. You get these super cool 3D glasses to wear. This one is a sequel to Ludwig the Space Dog. Now we have Ludwig the Sea Dog, so he and his friends get to jump into a wild world of the sea. And so if you're wearing your 3D glasses, then these images would literally pop out of the page at, at you. Luna loves Library Day. So in this book, um, it does have a mild undertone of Luna's parents being separated. Luna's mom takes her on Saturdays, drops her off at the library where she gets to have a wonderful adventure with her dad. So they go in here, they find all sorts of books, and then it's so cute, it says, into the book bag it goes, check. And then they come over here and they learn about magic, into the book bag it goes, check. And then even here, it's got a little story inside of a story, like this, into the bag it goes, check. And then this one, super cool, What's Above. We previously have a book called What's Below. And so now this is kind of the flip version of What's Above. So this one is kind of a pop-up book, but like literally the whole thing comes up and says, What's Above the Pond? And it talks about everything that's above here. And again, this one, What's Above? And you can see everything and it has even like layers inside. My son loves this one. Um, because it's very interactive um, and very really quite gorgeous. Coder Academy. Oh my goodness, I need this one for myself. If you have somebody that's super into learning how things work or computers, gaming, that kind of thing, this one is Coder Academy. Um, it's kind of a follow-up to our Architect Academy or Engineer Academy. Um, it literally teaches them step-by-step -step how to do coding and after they complete each section they get a badge um, until you get all the way into the end, here's all of your badges, and then it has this wonderful fold-out poster as well um, to say that they have completed the Coder Academy. Next up, another sequel to one of our series. It was one of our Graphic Legends series. So we also have Robin Hood and King Arthur. This one is Dracula. So any um, kid that likes comic books or likes these graphic novels is definitely going to like this one. Um, so this, of course, is for a little bit older reader. We have a couple of chapter book series as well. Bear Grylls. Um, so here's this one. They, this is two that are out right now. We also have several more that are coming out even in the next coming weeks. Um, so you can see him on the back there. And then here is the level of text. It's mostly words with a few illustrations on each page. So this is for a little bit of an older reader um, or for a younger reader if, if they're interested and you could read along with them as well. Another new series is our Tanglewood Animal Park series. So in this one, Zoe goes to live on a wildlife sanctuary. Um, and you can see through this one, this one is definitely mostly uh, chapter books. And then the only illustrations are when you transition to the next chapter. 
Last up, the next one I want to show you is kind of a book and kind of more than that. It's actually a puzzle, 300 pieces. So I kind of took it apart so you can see here are the sizes of the pieces inside. And then it does actually come with a book as well. This one is the Atlas of Our World picture book. And so it shows you everything on all of the different continents. And then it also has the flags of the world at the end. Alright guys, let your book lady know if we can help you find any recommendations for any of our mid-season fall 2017 books.